Asakusa, a cultural tapestry. Asakusa is famed for its deep historical roots. This district has maintained its cultural heritage while integrating with the modern vibrancy of Tokyo, making it a unique blend of the old and new. Its enduring customs and festivals continue to draw visitors eager to experience the continuity of history in the heart of a bustling metropolis. Kaminarimon Gate Gateway to History and Culture Kaminarimon, or Thunder Gate, is the iconic outer gate leading to Saint Soji Temple. Originally built in 942, it symbolizes the rich history of Asakusa and serves as a welcoming entrance to visitors. Nakamaya Shopping Street. A stroll through tradition. Lined with over 90 shops offering traditional snacks, crafts, and souvenirs. Established in the early 18th century, this street has been serving temple visitors for centuries, making it one of the oldest shopping areas in Japan. Visitors can find a variety of items such as yukata, folding fans, samurai replicas, and traditional sweets like ningyoyaki and taiyaki. This impressive structure is the Hozaman Gate. That ultimately lead to Saint Soji Temple in Asakusa, Tokyo. The gate serves as a guardian to the temple complex. Housing sacred treasures and historically significant manuscripts on its upper floor. Notable for its massive paper lantern and protective deity statues. It stands as a powerful symbol of both the physical and spiritual entrance to a place of deep cultural and historical significance. 
The Hose Amund's presence marks a threshold, inviting visitors to step from the bustling streets of Asakusa into a space of tranquility and tradition. These oversized straw sandals, known as waraji, are traditionally hung at the gates of temples in Japan. They symbolize the power and protection provided by the temple deities to ward off evil spirits and bring good luck to travelers. Visitors can engage in Amakuji, random fortunes written on strips of paper. When the prediction is bad, it is customary to fold up the strip and attach it to a wall of metal wires alongside other bad fortunes in the temple precincts. If it's good, you keep it. This is a Jokoro. Visitors use the smoke from the Jokoro to purify themselves before entering the temple. The practice involves waving the smoke towards oneself, particularly over parts of the body one wishes to heal or improve. This ritual is an integral part of the temple experience, symbolizing purification and preparation for prayer. This majestic building is the main hall, Kondo, of Sein Soji Temple. A place central to Asakusa's spiritual practice. The Hondo, where the main object of worship is enshrined, stands as a pivotal site for prayer and reflection. Its large lantern and intricate designs are characteristic of traditional Japanese temple architecture, and draw visitors from around the world to experience its grandeur and serene atmosphere. The large lanterns of Saint Soji, notably the one hanging at the Hondo, are significant cultural artifacts. They are traditional Japanese lanterns known as Chokan and are often inscribed with the names of donors. These lanterns are not only functional, providing light, but also serve a ceremonial purpose, symbolizing illumination both physical and spiritual. The Chozuya or purification fountain is integral for visitors to perform a cleansing ritual before prayer symbolizing the purification of body and spirit 
The majestic statue represents the Dragon God, a divine guardian in Japanese tradition, embodying strength and the power of nature. Dragons in Japanese culture are often associated with water and weather. Believed to bring rain for crops and thus symbolize fertility and prosperity. The five-story pagoda. Asakusa's towering heritage. Standing gracefully within the Sain Soji temple complex, the five-story pagoda is a monument of spiritual significance and architectural beauty. Representing the five elements. Earth, water, fire, wind, and sky. It points towards enlightenment. Each level ascends to a higher state of being a symbolic path followed in Buddhist practice. Visitors are often awed by its intricate woodwork and the presence it holds within the temple grounds. A historical testament enduring through centuries.